Hello everybody and welcome to SnackTube. A um, bit weird for this, me, to be honest. Um, it's been about three weeks, maybe, since I've actually recorded anything for the channel. Luckily, through the magic of scheduling videos in advance, there won't be a three-week gap for you guys. This will just be another video. But, uh, yeah, I actually caught the coronavirus. So, I was out of commission for a while there. I had, like, a full week where I was just completely unable to do anything. I was in absolute agony. And then about another week of just recovering. And then the third week, I just was couldn't be bothered doing anything. So yeah, it's been a long recovery getting over this coronavirus thing. I would not recommend it to anybody. It was horrible. So yeah, just uh, be safe out there. Make sure you're doing your social distancing and uh, just stick Stay at home. Just stay at home if you can, because it's uh, it is not nice catching this thing, and um, I'm just really definitely afraid of catching it again because it was horrible, really, really horrible. And I only I only went to the pub like twice, and then I caught it on the second time. So it uh, seems like it's really easy to catch. But I know plenty of people who've been out hundreds of times and never caught it, so they got lucky. I was unfortunately one of the victims of the coronavirus now. I'm one of the statistics. So, a bit of a shame. Anyway, moving on. I figured for my first video back since um, it's been a while since I've recorded something, I would try something that um, I've been wanting to do for a while because this, this has been out for a little bit now and um, the existence of it has it's confused me. So, what I've got for you is a Lost the Pot Noodle. Um, so Pot Noodle, the company that makes the pot noodles, have decided to start making packet noodles instead of doing it in the pot. They still do the pots, of course, um, but they decided to start doing these now. Um, seems like it's very similar to super noodles, because that, that would be your, your choice, wouldn't it? Normally it'd be a pot noodle if you want something just to do in a pot and just pour some water in or you can do something in a pan and have super noodles it's like the same kind of idea as super noodles oh well, apparently super noodles have got a pot version now as well so you can get super noodles in a pot which it's all going arse about face now i don't know i don't know why they're doing this because pot noodles are quite convenient i don't know why they would bother making them in a packet I guess we'll find out why, uh, what they taste like, I suppose. Um, so I got these ones. These are the roast chicken flavour because it's closest to my favourite pot noodle flavour, flavor, which is chicken and mushroom. Um, they don't, didn't have a chicken and mushroom one, just the roast chicken. So I figured I would try this. They had a few other flavours as well, which I might try later on down the line just to see what they're like. Um, so these are Lost the Pot Noodle. Uh, let's have a wee look and see what's actually... And them um, from the nation's favorite instant noodle brand, instant noodles with a sachet of roast chicken flavor seasoning. Conquer the kitchen in five minutes, and then it gives you instructions. Oh, want to stir up your dinner? Try adding sweet corn and broccoli to become the master of all noodlers. I'm not doing that. Um, if I'm eating these, it's just because I want something quick. I'm not chucking broccoli and stuff into it. What is this? Uh, so, yeah, there's not a lot on here, to be honest. Um, low saturated fat, just wing it. Let's have a look at the calories and whatnot. Uh, da -da -da -da. Instant noodles with a sachet of roast chicken flavour seasoning. Per portion. This pack contains two portions. Serves two as part of a tasty main meal. I would normally just um, eat this all in one go. Just as a lunch or something. So... Um, we'll, we'll, we'll describe it as per portion then and see what they're saying. So 208 calories, which doesn't seem too bad. This is about the same as a pot noodle, but anyway, I think. Fat, 8.5 grams. That's that's quite high. 0 0.7 grams of saturates. That's that's all right. Um, carbs, 28 grams. That's quite a lot. Of course, that's the noodles, um, of which sugar is 2.1 grams, which is low. 1.1 gram of fiber, 4.5 grams of protein, 0 0.83 grams of salt. So quite high in salt for what it is. Um, what are the actual ingredients in here? Noodles, 92%, which are made from wheat flour, rapeseed oil, potato starch, salt, raisin agents, um, antioxidant, and then the roast chicken flavour seasoning, which is 8%, which has got maltodextrin, modified starch flavouring, salt, sugar, carrots, potassium chloride, yeast extract, onion powder, garlic powder, parsley, turmeric, black pepper, acid, sage. May contain crustaceans, soy, milk, celery, and mustard. Oh, pot noodles owned by Unilever. 
which is uh, quite a big company. They own a lot of stuff, lots of food stuff and um, like cleaning supplies and things like that. Lots of stuff you get in the supermarket is, is made by Unilever. Uh, so there you go. Oh, there's no added MSG. How fantastic. MSG is all right. I actually put MSG on Asian dishes when I make them, Chinese dishes. So just wing it in five minutes. This is the Lost the Pot Noodle Roast Chicken flavor. So I'll show you it again. There it is. Um, I made it to the instructions on the packet. Um, that makes them absorb all the water. So it's not a soup. It is definitely just a, a mass of, of noodles. Um, they kind of look like pot noodle noodles, only a lot longer. They don't smell like pot noodles. It doesn't smell like a chicken and mushroom pot noodle. It smells like just a chicken thing. It smells more like the super noodles. But right, well, I suppose we should do it then. Let's uh, let's let's try these. These are lost the pot noodle roast chicken flavor. Let's uh, let's give them the old taste test. Ooh. <laughs> Wow. Very sticky. Very, very sticky. <laughs> well, I meant to show you. That's the size of the packet that comes with it. No soy sauce. Normally in a, pa in a chicken and mushroom pot noodle, you get some soy sauce. Which I think doesn't have enough soy sauce in it to be honest. I would add more soy sauce if I could. I am Tafulu. Nom nom nom. Come on Matty, don't play with your food. <laughs> okay. Well, first thing I'm noticing is that um, they're a lot more colourful than super noodles because they've got the bits of carrot in there and the little chivey things. Um, that's, that, that I'm going. I can only really compare these to super noodles because they're they're not like ramen, where the ramen is more of a more of a soup with noodles through it. Super noodles are you use a lower amount of water so that they they come out dead, um, dead, uh, dead gooey. And I like gooey super noodles. These aren't these aren't gooey. They're more sticky, which um, isn't as good to be honest. Um, if I compare it to the pot noodle noodles, um, they're about the same. Maybe a bit better than the pot noodle noodles. The pot noodle noodles, because you put so much water in them, they tend to get quite watery. Although, the funny thing is, a pot, I would say an actual pot noodle in a pot has a lot more flavour than this. This is this is all a bit. It is quite bland. It's definitely got that chickeny flavour, and it's it's closer to the flavour of chicken super noodles than it is to the flavour of a chicken and mushroom pot noodle. But uh, it is really quite bland. Yeah, really quite bland. And a, a pot noodle has little bits of sweet corn in it. Little bits of mushroom in it as well, which adds to the flavour and the texture. Whereas this is just a just a mass of sticky noodles, and the roast chicken flavour isn't very pronounced. It's a bit very very dialed back. It's there, but it's bland. So it's actually quite disappointing. Um, I was expecting a lot more from the pot noodle people because I like pot noodles. Um, I really enjoy a chicken and mushroom pot noodle, but. And this definitely isn't as good as a chicken and mushroom pot noodle, for sure. Not as much flavour. Um, the texture of the, the, the noodles is better, I would say, than in an actual pot noodle. Um, I think that's going to happen anytime you cook it in a pan rather than cooking it just by adding water. Uh, so I would say that the texture of the actual noodles themselves is better. But it could do with a, a little bit more water, I would say, just to help to lubricate it a bit more. Although all that would that would also help to dilute the flavour and the flavour's lacking enough as it is. So yeah. Hard, it's gonna be hard to find that balance of flavour with these things. I might have to add a bit of a bit of salt, which 
you shouldn't have to do. Um, super noodles, I, I would say super, like the super noodles chicken, just chicken super noodles are better than these, definitely. Definitely. So I, I would I would stick to them instead of going with the pot noodles or the lost the pot noodles. Um, either have that or have a chicken and mushroom pot noodle because this um, for something it definitely it's in the middle. It's in between the two, uh, while not being as good as either of them. So, yeah, it's a bit, bit poor, a bit, a uh, bit flavourless, and mm. yeah, just a bit disappointed to be honest. I'll try and get some of the super noodles that come in a pot to try those and see what they're like. Um, see how they compare to the normal super noodles, but. Yeah, I would say the the I wouldn't have these again. I wouldn't bother. I mean, I like super noodles. I really like super noodles. I get all the different flavors, and I I love making them. I love having them, and they're, they're really nice. This uh, this just doesn't come close to being as good as super noodles, and um, it's not as good as a pot noodle either. So I would chuck that in the bin and just have. Either of the other two. Yeah. Poor. Sure. Definitely. Well, that'll do it for today, I think. Um, a disappointing meal for coming back after not recording anything in a few weeks, but hopefully I can get a few videos recorded over the next few days and create my backlog again, because my backlog has basically disappeared since I've um, been sick. So... Uh, yeah, need to record some stuff for you guys so you've got plenty of stuff to watch. Um, if you like this video, subscribe to the channel, hit the wee bell to get notifications anytime one of my videos comes out. Leave me a comment as well. Um, let me know what you think of these if you've had them before, and uh, let me know what you think I should re review next. You know, because I do take um, suggestions. Sometimes it takes a while before I get around to actually reviewing it. Like with the Buckfast, that took about eight or nine months but uh, I did it eventually and um, yeah I'll, I'll review anything as long as it's um, affordable because I'm not going to go out and spend 20 quid to review something uh, so that's it lost the pot lo 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 lost the pot noodles roast chicken flavor just wing it in five minutes pish very pish well thank you very much for watching I will catch you guys in the next video later